<laughs> wow, I just recorded like I just I just went through like thirty minutes of talking or twenty minutes straight through. And I didn't record any of it. So maybe your prayers were answered. <laughs> Cause that was what I was gonna talk about. Prayers and looking out for yourself. I hope you do. I hope you choose to find a way to have some level of control in your life that is not self-harm because I mean or like I mean because I mean like I'm just as guilty of it as you are or just as I'm just as I do it as I do it my way or the way that I've my habits are I I smoke cigarettes I or cigars I say stuff about myself in a way that is like negative or like um hurtful I think of hurtful things to say about myself all the time uh or mean and for a long time it was like where I'd be like it's better it's oh it's so much better for me to say the worst things about myself or come up with the worst things to say about myself or the worst feelings about what I'm doing or perspective on how I'm doing things contrary to what you know would be considered positive or self-affirming you know because I wasn't like cutting myself or like you know burning myself I was smoking and doing that and uh I mean I can't promise you right now like yeah if you stop cutting I'll stop smoking you know I'm not gonna have that talk with you you know somebody wants to challenge that with me we can try to challenge that you know I, I'm just saying <clears throat> so I try to be bigger than I make more of a concentrated effort on it and one way to do it is just to say that I'm going to be bigger than any kind of criticism I level on myself or anyone else and I'm going to try to inspire other people to be bigger than that and you know whether or not somebody else wants to call me trying I want to be motivational speaker or uh, trying to be like a wannabe preacher or like counselor or whatever, you know, whatever they, their takeaway is from what I'm doing. But like, you know, I'm just, I'm just a person, I'm a guy, I'm a man, American, white guy with a mustache and glasses just saying, yo, be bigger than the stuff that you put on your, you put, be bigger than your problems or your personal beast with yourself or squabbles you have with yourself the self-destructive tendencies you know be just be bigger than it it doesn't matter if you i mean i'm not saying like you gotta cut all that shit not no pun intended <laughs> stopping everything you're doing that would be considered self-harm or itself i'm not saying that i'm not saying you're a bad person for doing it. i'm not demanding that you do these things what i'm saying is, is just, just put that at the forefront of your day just do it right now just confirm with yourself that you know it's like, you know, you, that you're a part of everything in the universe and you have a place here. You know, this is your home. This is your world. This is, this is you're, you're amongst your people. All the differences that we have amongst each other, all the political, religious, everything, ideologies that conflict with people or just like the basic primal things that we have that we conflict with each other on or even like on a very superficial material level, the things that we argue about and like, fight against each other on is that you are at home this is your home this is your place you deserve to find happiness and damn it you're gonna be bigger than the shit that you throw at yourself because i mean you're gonna if you're gonna arm this is the thing if you're gonna arm other people with these things that you, you know because i mean whatever you do whether you're like you know straight and narrow like whatever clean cut kid or person whatever again no pun intended that you're gonna you're gonna come up against people that are gonna like you say hate on you or just be opposite of what you do or how you feel or judge you and stuff like that is that you're gonna put out something about yourself that other people are gonna pick on or you're gonna give me you're gonna you're going to do it, but you're going to do it with this thing called, like, you know, this level of, like, you know, being, like, you know, I'm bigger than, like, you know, it's like, you know, I could be like, oh, I'm so lazy. I'm so, I'm so lazy. I'm gross. I, I am overweight. I, 
my thighs rub together. I feel my breast jiggle when I run. Um, I'm missing a tooth. Uh, I'm stupid. Whatever. It doesn't. It doesn't matter because I'm still gonna try to be. I'm just gonna be bigger than that. Because I mean, it's easy. It. I mean, I'm not saying it's easy to get to that point. I'm just saying it. I'm, it's the easy way out of like just running running through my, a gauntlet in my own mind and then then trying to like put myself back together to to actually like cohabitate with others and like genuinely show people that like yes I do think about my life and humanity and other people my effect on other people and all this other shit that people won't pick up on because you know you're constantly destroying yourself and they don't want to watch it they don't want to be around it they don't want to get they don't want that to become like a habit that they form from being around it, you know what I'm saying? And so it takes strong people, like strong people to step in and be like, you know, stronger than me, that and step in and like, you know, or like, yo, like, what's up? Like, yo, what's, how you doing? Like, yo, like, you know? Cause I mean, we're all suffering from certain things. We're all dealing with certain issues. And the thing is, is that, you know, one moment somebody might just say that little bit to the person and, you know, change just the, you know, just be like, you know, moment of clarity, whatever you want to call it. So, 